Deepak, shall we start? Deepak, uh, Deepak. It's audible, please. Please, hands up. Yeah, you are audible. Oh, thank you. Thank you. So much. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon. Good evening. Good evening. Good, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Let's we start. Uh, my name is uh, Siraj Ahmed Khan. I am the business development manager in GBS. I am taking care of India market, uh, particularly uh, UP, Uttarakhand, Rajasthan, MP, and some president of the Gujarat. Okay. So uh, we will start the this uh, presentation. Thereafter, we have a uh, question session where we ask any question. Okay. Fine. Hello, Siraj. Yes. Uh, Deepa, uh, you can uh, also make a uh, uh, show the panelist and you can then transfer her to the host, like because I have made you the host, so you will have to make a uh, show the host if you want, like if she wants to share the screen. Sure, sure, sure. sure. Yeah, okay.
హలో సిరాజ్ అయ్యుదే హా yes yes i'm just trying to boost me please yeah just click the three buttons besides her name and you can make her the panelist first promote to panelist Oh, there is, oh, sorry, uh, Deepa, there is no three button of the... Yeah, there will be three bu- button besides the name, okay? Ashu Mogla's name. And, and then on that side, you can click promote to panelist, okay? And once she is panelist, then you can make her the host. no you are the host no yeah i am the host i will do that i will do that for ashu just a moment where is she ashu hello hello hi Deepa. ashu sorry to keep ashu. you waiting i'm really sorry <laughs> actually i had a problem with my system previously i will just okay. to make make you the host no no just keep uh... Uh, who is going to present the screen you or shiraj i'm going just to keep, keep yeah just, oh, just okay. keep shiraj as host and uh, i'll yeah. i'll uh, you know fine i will make shiraj the host okay okay so shiraj you can okay. start now okay i have make you the host yes, okay. uh good evening everyone uh, as uh, i told you i'm i'm shiraj amit khan i am business development manager uh, india i am looking for the as i tell you uh, the up mp uh, uh, rajasthan and uk as well some part of the rajasthan and here my uh, senior uh, ms ashu mogla who is uh, based in uh, london okay so i'll start the presentation if there is any question uh, at the end of the uh, presentation we will clarify the order queries okay okay siraj it's visible to everyone uh, yes yes suraj you can proceed yes please oh. uh gbs dubai uh, changing lives through education so i'll just start the presentation please okay. there... gbs we were changing lives through education GBS began in 2010 as a specialist training center for finance and investment banking. Students around the world could access specialist courses both online and on campus. The move into higher education came in 2012 with a range of management courses for international students. In 2016, we turned our attention to the Tower Hamlets borough of East London. where many prospective learners found themselves underserved and even ignored by more traditional colleges and universities. We wanted to challenge that and put an end to the idea that some people are just not suited to certain sectors because of backgrounds, demographics or often because they simply don't possess the qualifications or have a been to university. This was the start of our core GBS community and set us firmly on the path to realizing our vision of changing lives through education. That GBS community is now
Guys, are you able to hear it? I'm not able to hear. No, earlier it was like audible, but now it is not. No audio, no audio. Okay, I think it's finished in English now. No, it's audible. Okay. Sira. I think initially it was audible, but in the middle, the volume was not there. Mm -hmm. But anyways, you can continue with, with the presentation now. Yes. Okay, friend. Uh, Dr. Vishwajit Rana is our uh, CEO of the company and who uh, lived in uh, London. And uh, they are the advisory uh, member of the uh, GBS. And this, uh, Lady Gabriela Vincent is the executive member of, of the GBS as well. Okay. And this is our uh, executive leadership team under we uh, do the serve the all the courses or all the uh, things in uh, J2. And the uh, Professor Lorai, Chief Executive Officer in uh, in London, who is taking care of the, all the uh, uh, centers in uh, London as well. And uh, Mr. Leo Falcano is a group managing director who is in uh, London. They are all they are for our the executive leadership team. Uh, they are very highly profiled prof, uh, profile, uh, persons and uh, uh, very electrical person in the in education industries. Under uh, these 400 guidance, we are serving the all the GPS uh, courses and as well. And GPS network as as uh, in video we have uh, show you key, we are in. Uh, uh, UK, there are the we have the uh, uh, four campuses with ten centers, uh, ten centers in London, Bingham, Manchester, Leeds, and uh, last when we, uh, last year we have opened our first international campus in Dubai, and uh, now we are new a campus in Malta, and uh, very soon we are going to new uh, destination as well uh, like Germany, Australia, and Canada and Ireland as well. GPS. GPS is a global banking school uh, academic provider. Okay, we uh, offer the uh, certificate program, diploma as well, and the higher education as well also. And our goal is basically help a student to competitive in today's job market. We easily learn the professional courses and easily get the job in their market. Okay, so we uh, provide their uh, particular trainings for the uh, 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 for the communication and how to they face the interviews and how to they react with the employees as well. And pay special attention and will academics professional orientation in addition to our slices too. Because uh, if any students come and he have to go academics, he is not able to uh, face the interview or he is not able to uh, connect with the, their uh, employer, so how he gets the better opportunity. So we will provide their, that kind of uh, academics in the GBS, they easily uh, get the jobs in the market as well. Okay. So GBS DY is an indication of the international organization, uh, GBS, and campuses in three countries, UK, Malta, and U, UAE. So now we are today talking about the uh, uh, Dubai campus. The very big question now these days, is why we send the students to Dubai for the education? As most of the people, uh, when they come about, they know about the Dubai. They, the first question we are easily go the Dubai for the um, jobs as a skill worker, as something as a tourist destination. But very few, some people know about the uh, Dubai is a new destination. Uh, we exploring the slowly, slowly for the education hub. So if you see the lots of the big universities, all uh, they are coming up the uh, Dubai and open their campuses. So it means uh, Dubai is coming up the very, uh, uh, very highest demanding uh, education institution. Okay. okay. So why? Uh, so basically, when GBS see all the things, and and they have opened their own campus in uh, Dubai, the three the few things is there. Okay. The first of all, ninety-one percent of the all education satisfaction in our. Uh, like uh, uh, in the UK, the most of the students very satisfied in the, with their academics and all the training. That's why they are open their uh, 
the GVS campus, uh, Dubai campus, and there they are providing the good quality of the uh, academics. So first of all, the 90% of satisfaction and the uh, 90%, 91% of the uh, quality of teaching and courses. <clears throat> Uh, 93% range of the opportunity of for the learning and the uh, 10 to 20% uh, achieve we, the student achieve their uh, uh, goals in their whatever they want to uh, learn and learn. And 90% quality of assessment and feedback as for the survey of the 22. Okay, so the uh, few of these things the GPS has opened the campus in Dubai. Thereafter, the which are the students are studying in Dubai now they are much more satisfied with the academics and all the things. The, the some uh, USP of the uh, GBS Dubai, the first of all, the flexibility, the flexibility in schedule. If any student enroll uh, in GBS, they can opt the uh, several type of the uh, um, uh, schedule, uh, like uh, they can be uh, join the classes in day timing, evening or weekends as per their flex choices. <clears throat> Lecture with the experience in the field of most of the practitioners. The lecturers, we are there providing the education, academics, they are much, much uh, qualified and professional. Access to and uh, easy to understand hands on lectures. Okay. The format is very good. The personal attention to each student because the, the class size is very small. Uh, eight to 10 students or 15 students, the class in size. So the every student get the attention uh, with the uh, lecturers and all as well and career center job search assistance we also provide the student uh, assistance in the to get the part-time job or as well after completion the uh, courses we also assist them to how to get their uh, permanent job in as well dubai okay and the communication with the past alumni we are also organizing some uh, get together uh, parties and get together the uh, things where the uh, previous student came and uh, uh, chat with the uh, current students that they come to know how to uh, get the job and how, how to uh, they provide all the things. Advantage during the the best part of the Dubai is uh, like the other countries. The student uh, student enroll in uh, Dubai during the study student can uh, work part do uh, part time work in Dubai. Uh, is unlimited. There is no any art, uh, is a time uh, fix. He, they work in a 20 hours, 30 hours. They can do the work as per their capability. We do not uh, require, second thing, the first, first point is uh, Dubai part time. And second is we do not require any financial bank statement for the visa purpose. Okay. The best thing if, if it's been applied in other countries, uh, the second most uh, required thing is a fund show. So because of the loss of the student do not uh, complete the visa processing. But here, the student not need to show any kind of the bank statement for the, and the fund show all things. The quick and easy visa process. Okay. And uh, Dubai, there are uh, benefits like that they will easily get the job. And there are lots of the uh, career company uh, available in the, uh, Dubai. They easily uh, provide the job to everyone. And uh, uh, salary, the what's the general uh, question? The what kind of the salary they are we expecting in Dubai? So, unskilled worker 800 to 2200 USD, they easily get the job in Dubai for the okay. And skilled worker 1200 to 20,000 USD, they easily get the uh, job in Dubai. So, it means there are lots of opportunity in Dubai. The uh, student can get the job easily over there. That's a uh, good thing uh, because if you see in other parts of the destination the job there are part time is available but the permanent job is not particularly available in their particular destinations so if any student complete their studies in uh, dubai they easily get the permanent job over there and we also help them the student to get the job high salary the other usps of the uh, dubai the high salary, the average salary in USD 55K compared to USD 45 in Canada. Okay, so the, the salary is much, much higher than the other destinations. If you're uh, getting the job in other destinations like the Canada, UK or Australia and so on. But in Dubai, he's getting the job, he easily get the high salaries in Dubai. And uh, the, the second thing is 
everywhere the taxes but in dubai the only country where the if any if you are earning anything you need to pay any taxes so whatever you earn you easily get it the fully okay the low cost of living uh, the cost of living is much much lower than the other destinations other countries uh, where the student generally go for the other countries where they they, they have to pay the for the accommodation higher uh, okay so in in terms of the uh, cost the student or the as well as the uh, uh, people who are uh, living over there they are they are much much very less amount uh, invest on the uh, accommodation as well okay for international there are there is a only a country where the 90% of the populations are expats if you go around the any uh, market area or any 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 places you see that there are the the uae person is living very some but the other destiny other peoples other countries peoples are easily will get the over there uh a uh, growing economy and and continuous population growth uh they are increasing the population day by day and they are, they have a target by the 27 they will increase 1.7 million people over in dubai and the the uh, as the uh, uh, english is as a second official language as well so uh, it means ki who uh, who easily speak the english he can easily survive in dubai it means doesn't mean that they know the arabic language or not okay equal opportunities all the labels for the all nationalities okay simple visa process is a, dubai visa one of the easiest visa in the world for the visa process you need to provide the any kind of the gap declaration for no need to uh, the punch as I, I i told you as earlier and there is need to know uh, you know you you not worry about the visa process because the institution process the visa for the students so you just give the all documents to the uh, gbs gbs team will process the visa and for the students as well. guys now the voice is clear i think now it's clear I think, guys, before we move on to the courses, what we offer, let's just see from the team members if they have any questions regarding Dubai as a country, as a destination, and uh, if they have any question queries regarding, uh, you know, uh, student work rights or anything in Dubai itself. Deepa has already been to the campus, so she yes. she has campus. Has seen the facilities. She has seen yeah. our hostel facilities as well. We were in fact staying in the back. same accommodation, like which is for the student. And I must say that it's very, really very nice for the students. That like they would not be facing any problems while staying over there. Guys, kisi ko koi bhi question hai Dubai ke baare mein, please uh, you can unmute yourself and uh, please feel free to ask. If you so, so let's start with the uh, academics. Oh uh, yes. Okay. So um, as a uh, division, the this presentation I just show you uh, show you can we have the uh, tied up with the uh, University of Suffolk, Pearson, Baspa, Leeds. Can, Uh, leads uh, Canterbury Christ Church and uh, Canterbury Christ Church. So in Dubai, uh, we are uh, providing the Pearson programs for whatever the student complete their academics. We uh, provide the Pearson certificates. So uh, the in, in Pearson they have different kinds of level, and every level is equivalent to the the general academics. So uh, start with the we have the we are starting uh, Dubai level two. Level two is the uh, the basic. Uh, vocational training uh, level in it is a six month program in uh, uh, for those student who have not started their uh, studies ever so if they are student is 16 years old and he want to start the uh, career in a professional as a professional courses so he can opt the this courses okay so level 2 is 
one of the uh, low level program and the for the six months it means the it, student don't have any kind of the education like, like the high school certificate or even he not get in the school so <coughs> sorry <coughs> he can start from here the foundation uh, uh, level three is the foundation year uh, it's we can say it's like a high school or the uh, ninth class so if any student have uh, uh, passed class 10 to enroll in the foundation courses it's a a level program okay the same thing is level uh, level 4 and 5 level 4 5 is the uh, higher national certificate program and higher national diploma uh, when we uh, in, after level 3 if we enter in level 4 <coughs> sorry we start with the level 4 and we end the course with the level 5 we this uh, level 4 and 5 we did uh, along with it at the same time we we start with the level four so we cannot get the uh, we, we get the certificate we, this is not about much uh, <coughs> worthful so we should be complete level five then the certificate is complete okay and the level six is our the bachelor degree program equivalent bachelor degree program and the level seven is a master programs and level eight is our the phd and the other <coughs> programs So please understand this. Yes. Are you okay? You want me to take <coughs> uh, something? Actually, maybe uh, today I have the third infection. That's why the anyway, it's fine. <coughs> it's fine. So uh, please uh, see this chart is very carefully because the while the counseling the student, you need to show them because the if any student have a no certificate, then we enroll them the level two. If any student have uh, ten class certificate. Then we have to enroll then these students to level three. <coughs> and uh, uh, those students have completed the uh, class 12th. Mm -hmm. So uh, we, we enroll that student in a level four. And when the student entered in level four, he complete the education after uh, level five. It means whenever we uh, particularly see this uh, level four and five, that's why I'm uh, again uh, tell, uh, telling you this, this, because if any student enrolled in level five, level four, he have to complete the level five, then the certif uh, certificate is valuable. Otherwise he uh, finished his uh, education in level four and not go going for the level five, that certificate is not worth full. Okay, in uh, Dubai as well as anywhere. So whenever the, if you counsel any student, so tell them that he going for the two years studies, not for the one year studies. So after five, student can uh, apply for the top up degree or go with the level uh, six or the Pearson. And onwards, the level seven, level eight, he did the, after the uh, these courses. Okay. So so our uh, level four five is a graduation one year, and level six is our uh, final year of degree. Okay. If, if any question in, in this uh, labels, anyone? <coughs> Guys, anyone has any questions regarding Even what the, the agents level of... can type the questions in the question answers section or in the chat section. You can ask. Can we not actually unmute them? I think it's, it'll be easy uh -huh. if they can unmute themselves, ask yeah. straight away if they have any questions. Guys, let's make it more interactive session rather than just Siraj is, uh, you know, <coughs> speaking up and we don't even know whether uh, actually know, things are very clear. <laughs> yes, sir. Deepa, if you can, un you know, unmute the, the team members as well. Actually, I would not have the access now because uh, Siraj is the host. That's why. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, yeah. Siraj, can you do it? You are the host, so maybe you can unmute everyone. Yes, he can. While Siraj is doing, I'll just, uh, you know, take this uh, little two minutes time to say the same thing which Siraj has just iterated uh, earlier also. Guys, in Dubai, we start offering the courses from level two onwards. And level two, it's a six months diploma. And this is for the students, those who don't have any qualification at all. You know, even if they have passed eighth, seventh, eighth, ninth qualification, which is below 10th. So anyone who still wants to come back to education, if they don't have any previous qualifications, they can start with level two diploma. 
all they need is a very very basic english level and that's all passport copy very basic level of english and that's where we can start the student to from level 2 but level 2 itself is not enough after 6 months of level 2 that course that certificate of pearson diploma will allow the student to jump on to the level 3 qualification which is actually the main major foundation course what we offer so level 3 is a foundation course one year uh, duration this is for the student those who have passed secondary india mein kitni kaun si qualification chalti hain jisko hum secondary bol dete hain hum 10th bol dete hain ईयर टेन क्वालिफिकेशन हो जाती हैं जो भी अराउंड टेंथ लेवल तक के स्टूडेंट्स हैं जिन्होंने काफ़ी साल पहले भी टेंथ किया हुआ है फॉर देम ऑल्सो इफ दे वॉन्ट टू कम बैक टू स्टडी फाउंडेशन कोर्स इज द बेस्ट टू स्टार्ट विद बेसिक बी वन लेवल तक का हमें इंग्लिश रिक्वायरमेंट चाहिए स्टूडेंट्स के लिए वी आर नॉट आस्किंग फॉर एनी आयल्स और एनी थिंग वो हम स्टूडेंट के साथ वन टू वन कॉन्वर्सेशन करके उनका लेवल ऑफ इंग्लिश जज कर लेते हैं एडमिशन टीम इज इज़ वेरी मच ट्रेन टू डू दैट दैट जॉब फॉर अस and that what we need for level 3 is passport copy and qualification which is 10th any student 10th and above qualification can easily join level 3 foundation and we offer these foundation in two different streams business and it depend karta hai student ka kya interest hai student can actually join the course uh, foundation course Palak, to answer your question, IELTS is not mandatory. As I said, हमे IELTS की कोई जरूरत नहीं है, कोई English proficiency दिखाने की जरूरत नहीं है student को. Um, all we need is student जब application करता है, the first step once you submit the application on online portal, the first step which admissions team does is they check two things: whether the student passport is there and the student qualification documents are there. Uh, as per whatever the course student is applying for, or उसके बाद first step is कि हम student का interview करते हैं, and it's not even an interview, it's more of the communication what we do with the student just to see कि student का क्या level है. हमारे लिए communication skills important हैं rather than having a proper IELTS score. Because what matters in Dubai is अगर किसी student को successful life चाहिए Dubai में what matters is their communication skills. If they want to succeed in class, class में भी तभी पढ़ पाएगा अगर उसके communication skills अच्छे हैं and then second thing which हम लोग भी बहुत focus करके चलते हैं which is work and study, right? So student जब study करने आता है तो second thing what they what is important for them is is their work. हर student part time work के लिए uh, you know uh, they all look forward for part time work. They all wanted to work part time as well to put their you know classroom skills into the practical skills and to get into a job what mandatory in dubai is is your communication skills unki english achhi honi chahiye that's what we need depend karta hai which level the student is coming somewhere around b1 level ka english hame chahiye hoga b1 level we all know student should be able to you know understand your questions they will be able to answer you back whatever the questions been asked hamara wo pre cas interview jaisa wo strict in इंटरव्यू नहीं है इट्स जस्ट मोर ऑफ द कम्युनिकेशन वेरी बेसिक कम्युनिकेशन जो हम करते हैं स्टूडेंट के साथ एंड इफ द स्टूडेंट इज एबल टू डू दैट वी आर हैप्पी टू एक्सेप्ट द स्टूडेंट फॉर आर लेवल थ्री फाउंडेशन कोर्सेज एंड ऑन टॉप ऑफ दैट लेवल थ्री के बाद हमारे पास आ जाते हैं दो दो साल के एच एंड डी डिप्लोमाज विच इज लेवल फोर एंड फाइव आई थिंक सिराज विल टेक ओवर हम लोग बिजनेस एंड मैनेजमेंट के डिप्लोमाज जो हैं ऑफर करते हैं इसमें काफ़ी स्पेशलाइजेशन अवेलेबल है स्टूडेंट्स के लिए हमारे पास कंस्ट्रक्शन मैनेजमेंट है हमारे पास इंफॉर्मेशन टेक्नोलॉजी है विच कवर्स डिजिटल टेक्नोलॉजी एज वेल एज क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग के कोर्सेज हैं हमारे पास और एक स्पेशल कोर्स जो है विच इज़ एजुकेशन एंड ट्रेनिंग उसके लिए क्राइटेरियाज आई थिंक सिराज विल कवर फॉर यू गाइज Siraj, you wanna take over? Uh, yes, but sir. let's just finish these questions which we have. Yes. Okay. Sia, you you asked regarding the fee structure. So for level two diploma, the fee structure is a little lower because it's a six months diploma, which is twenty five thousand dirhams. Because in Dubai, that's the currency we go by twenty five thousand dirhams. Apart from level two, student joining for level three, level four, or level five courses, the fee structure is forty thousand dirhams a year. we do offer certain scholarships as well to the students and we do offer we do have accommodation offers as well we will discuss that in in due time 
uh, there is one question regarding the age limit there is no well minimum age limit if i would say i think it's best to have a student with the minimum age at least 16 years kyunki 16 years is little a uh, mature student what we call and above upper side there is no age limit because for us in dubai we believe in give, giving second chances to everyone people those who have left their studies for any reasons pehle nahi pad paye because kuch family reasons the kuch financial reasons the ya kuch bhi reason tha if there is a gap in study and the somebody wants to actually come back to study we are happy to accept the student so to answer your question there is no upper age limit Because we accept the students with the huge gaps as well. Ten years का भी अगर gap है study में बारह साल का gap है there is no issue at all. Stay back option के लिए generally students को वहाँ पे work visas मिल जाते हैं once they complete their diplomas with us. लेकिन uh, apart from that minimum three maximum six month के उनको वो अपना visas जो हैं वो extend कर सकते हैं up to six months option है उनके पास. If a student is studying in Dubai and then he wants to study last in the UK, with us, हमारी जो हमारी institutions के साथ जो collaboration है, any student who is studying in GBS Dubai campus for level four and five, and after that, if they want to switch to UK for a bachelor's top up degree course, IELTS is not mandatory for them. Neither for visa nor for admissions. दोनों के लिए IELTS की कोई compulsion नहीं है. That is again the beauty of studying. Pearson courses in GBS. Like, same thing, like, uh, we have covered the fees. We have covered the age limit. Yes. So they can ask me, okay, look, uh, Durgesh, you are not able to uh, listen to my voice, or you are not able to speak up. I think we have answered most of the questions, and uh, Siraj, Siraj, you can, can yeah, you can proceed, yeah. Siraj. Yes. Siraj, you are there. Oh sorry, ah uh, okay, it's fine. After ah uh, GBS is offering the ah uh, five streams uh, in uh, courses. Ah uh, first, ah uh, business and management, construction management, information technology, education and uh, education and training, and global banking. After completion the courses uh, in these stream, a student easily get the job in uh, Dubai because uh, they are the business hub, tourist hub, and the construction ah uh, going on there. too much and the information technology they have set up the offices from the different different companies in dubai so they easily and education and training uh, the education and training one of the very uh, good uh, course in uh, gbs after this uh, a student easily get the job over there so in the why the uh, the uh, course uh, details i'll tell you why the, this course is very uh, good in uh, dubai and as well the global banking school the first uh, basic certificate from as a to level 2 so the any student who don't have any education as the uh, ms ashu has told and i also uh, told about this so if any student any kind of the certificate they start the uh, his career in diploma in business uh, level 6 uh, it's a 6 month program and uh, uh, the the fees is 25000 dirham okay so uh, any student not uh, yet he not start his career So at least he is start the from the scratch here in Dubai as well. Okay. The uh, uh, second uh, the which from uh, program is level three extended diploma in business. If a student complete the level two uh, after that uh, level two student uh, not do any other uh, courses he should be go for the level three after uh, sorry uh, uh, level three student who have passed the class tenth. Who get enrolled in this program? Okay, the fees of this uh, course is uh, uh, forty thousand dirham, and the duration of the course is twelve months. Okay, so for the one year, 
the students we complete this courses okay uh, after uh, after a level 3 the student uh, go with the level 4 or he can opt the other option but he can go for the uh, uh, in other countries like uh, uk canada and australia but to in the pearson uh, partnership universities and institutions okay he can apply for the in the, these courses after uh, th level 3 and the second a very uh, good program is this uh, diploma in it if any student very uh, he wants to make career in uh, it technology and cloud computing and other uh, uh, courses so he go for the uh, level 3 uh, the qualification of the this uh, the criteria is the same as the uh, previous one the student should be passed the uh, class 10 okay, the, uh, the duration of the course is 12 months the fees of this course is 40000 dirham after this the student can also go for the uh, other uh, destination uh, in the uh, precise with the uh, pearson institutions the this uh, now uh, this is a uh, level 4 5 international business uh, who student have completed the class 12 education in india he can apply for these courses the level 4 and 5 so as that time i have told you the uh, student uh, we start with the level 4 and finish with the level then it's a, this is this certificate is uh, is uh, worth full at the level 4 uh, as a bachelor one year and level 5 is a bachelor two year thereafter student can uh, complete the graduation in as well and uh, gbs or he go for the top of degree in other country like uk canada australia and other countries so he can apply for the top of degree and that scenario he he, he or she do not uh, required the ielts score for the the core duration of the this uh, course is uh, 24 months Le uh, for level 4 is 12 months and the level 5 for the uh, 12 months the fees of this course is uh, 40000 dirham per year okay the other course is uh, level 4 5 the te uh, digital technology who have uh, completed the uh, class 12 uh, in india he can apply for these courses okay the same thing the course is uh, for the two years the fees per year is uh, 40000 dirham the another program is the same in it sector the diploma in higher national diploma and certificate cloud computing it's a very uh, demanding course in, uh, nowadays so the most of the student who have completed their uh, class 12 in india and they want to make career in uh, it sector uh, industry and uh, now most of the student much much interested for the uh, cloud computing courses so and there are a lot of the job opportunity as well in dubai as well as in the other destination as well so the course uh, and course fees is the, for this course is 40000 dirham for per year and the level 4 is uh, 12 months and the level 5 is for the 12 months program <clears throat> the very uh, this is the uh, another program construction management uh, in dubai this uh, program is in very demand because the now uh, dubai is day by day there are lots of construction was going on the who have complete these courses after level 4 5 they can easily get uh, the job in dubai because there are a lot of construction was going on so uh, who have completed uh, their uh, 12th standard in india and they want to make career in india in uh, uh, engineering in civil engineering so at least they can start from this course uh, the level 4 and 5 and there they easily get the job and uh, while this uh, job after that he can complete their top up degree over there in any institution in other countries as well because the if if if, if any uh, any one student have have not much uh, budget for the engineering program so at least they start the career in dubai with this program so so can they easily uh, complete their engineering program after the completing the all the courses okay the uh, course fees is 40000 dirham uh, for level 4 and level 5 is 40000 dirham for us and the the very uh, a very good program 
in dubai in very demanding as well very good for the especially for the girls who want to make a career in uh, teaching this course this this course is the education and training program for level 5 actually who have completed their graduation in any uh, stream whatever bcom bsc ba in so he she can apply for this courses so after completing this course the student can easily get job in dubai in in, in schools and there are some institutions as well <clears throat> the course fees is the same course is the 40000 dirham and duration is one year so this courses are very demanding who have completed the graduation after graduation you want to make career in a teaching line or another so easily apply for this and the good of the the, uh, the course of this uh, is, is very good is they can uh, sorry the equivalent of the first two years of the bachelor studies uh, this is the uh, international uh, diplomas uh, uh, details is the equivalent of the first two years of the bachelor degree level 4 and 5 two years in accreditation after completion it is possible to find an employer and a transfer to work visa in, in the ue so the minimum asks for the, the after uh, the stay back option so if any student complete their study they easily uh, job easily get the job in dubai and they start working very soon or apply for the top up degree in uk so and when they apply for the uk for the top up degree of uh, level 6 that time they they need, they no need the ielts scores <clears throat> what is the top up so, the winner program at the british university uh, upon completion the student receive their bachelor degree upon graduation the student has to write to apply for the post graduate permit for the two years if any student complete their study in uk they are uh, they are they, they easily get the psw for the two years list of okay and this uh, link i'll share with the uh, deepa uh, that time he, he, she she will show you the how many universities we are recognized with the psw universities okay sure sure the the last program is of the very uh, a uh, uh, very short term program we have one that's a global bank investment banking analyst program it's a four weeks program who wants to make a career in banking and finances they can join this program okay if he if he completed his uh, the graduation or any uh, level he or, or any professional he can apply for this courses okay so uh, the these are the program we have uh, uh, the, I, i told you the diploma in international business level 4 5 diploma in digital technology level 4 5 diploma in cloud computing level 4 and 5 diploma in construction management level 4 and 5 these are programs which i have told you the the simple requirement of the uh, the level 3 is 10th uh, pass student can apply for the level 3 and level 4 a uh, 12 pass student can apply for these courses and uh, we have written over there that there is a requirement of the ielts but as of now we not ask for the any uh, ielts score okay so we just take the credibility interview over the, and in that we can came to know the students eligible for the courses or not okay visa process uh, the admission and visa process the, the process of the application and visa is very easy uh, the application process uh, is uh, in in a in one day pro, uh, the process once the applications are uploaded on the platform our uh, team admission team will take the credibility interview thereafter we'll issue the uh, offer letter okay so offer let, once they have received the offer letter they have to uh, accept the offer letter and they uh, pay the application uh, for the uh, tuition fee uh and thereafter uh, they submit the visa documents like passport uh one photograph and academics okay in that and when they uh, submit all the documents we start the process the visa process is the four to uh, sorry sir two to six weeks uh, uh, process time when they uh, submit all the documents okay and uh, when they arrive in uh, dubai uh, the student visa process is the four to eight weeks we submit their original passport in the office uh, the, they then they go for the uh, medical examination and uh, thereafter they will meet they get their uh, student pass after that they start the classes now student right to and they are when they receive the uh, pass thereafter they they can do the part time job as well over there okay 
so one of the very very easiest admission process and visa process uh, for the any uh, destination uh, in in one day you will get the offer letter uh, and the uh, two to six weeks you will get your visa and the, uh, the good thing is the visa success rate almost 100 percent very very rare cases will get the rejection in any visas if the student have any problem in their passport, then they uh, cancel their uh, visa. Otherwise, who is students applied for the in Dubai for the student, uh, they must be get the their uh, hundred percent visa. So we can say that at least our uh, visa ratio is hundred percent. Now this is the uh, our accommodation. The student uh, is uh, arrive in uh, sorry in uh, GBS campus. So this is a, our ESOC elevated study and accommodation and work a place where the student is live. So we have uh, this uh, hostel facility. Uh, Deepa is always have been there. Uh, she also seen all the things. Okay, how can I do the uh, this yes. uh, accommodation? About the, what right. kind of the facility they are providing over there? Each and every. The he also feel the if you are written here, he be providing. The yeah. Good <laughs> yeah. It's a very safe place to stay. The facilities yes. are really very good. We and, stayed yeah. there for three four days and we didn't face any issue over there. It's really a good place to stay for the students. And uh, daily shuttle services for the students and Wi-Fi and all all uh, utilities include the parking, the swimming pool, gym, uh, laundry, uh, separate male and female floors, a uh, shopping center nearby. There is four or five shopping malls nearby area. You will get the, all the things over there. So. After this, uh, I, I also show the one video of the, this uh, accommodation. This is a uh, ESO accommodation.
and uh, I also show you the, uh, the what kind of the prices for the uh, hostel. Uh, this is the brochure uh, for the uh, accommodation. This is the so the uh, location, as I told you, the location is very uh, prominent. Is uh, every uh, mall or every uh, supporting things or the easily get the, there are five uh, uh, mall over there. So you can easily get the, all the things that we are located near the Al Khel Gate. Uh, the knowledge village is 15 minutes uh, pass from there. Economic plus transport, Burj Khalifa view. Uh, the downtown is 10 minutes uh, uh, ride. For the public beach is 13 minutes. So lots of these of lots uh, kind uh, lots of things over there. That the Al Khel Community Center. You get uh, all these things over there. I I have been over there. They have seen all these things. The money exchange, clothing shopping, hypermarket, ATM, medical centers, pharmacy, gym, saloon, and the good uh, grocery uh, shops and the budget restaurants as well. And two minutes uh, walk from the Al Khel, you will take away the meal or anything. From over there, building facilities in building there are uh, 24 into 7 uh, security, digital cards, access for the building, numerous parking space, a high speed internet. Uh, a, a, every room have the air condition, and the cafeteria is also available over there. Uh, laundry facilities and the down uh, floor, and the gym, and all the things I've seen. Over. This is a, a floor plan, uh, single occupancy for the studio and uh, one uh, BDR, uh, double occupancy studio, uh, the other. Uh, and the floor plan is fifth floor. We have uh, five floors over there. The first, second, third, and fourth. And these are 18 units. And the fifth floor, there are eight units separate for the male and female. So there is no any messing for the girls, especially. There are security available also there for the girls, especially. And that's to, this kind of uh, facilities we are providing the room. Uh, the in suit room, the cooking facility, fridge, microwave, grill, kettle, penalty of storage, study decks. Each and everything will be there. The one bed uh, apart room, uh, and we provided the same facilities. The, there are the microwave, kettle, cooking stove, kettle penalty, sorry, study decks, almira, beds. And the good thing of the, the mattress we are providing is the uh, orthopedic mattresses. So is, is when the student is very tired and want to do uh, some rest, to so easily uh, get the uh, rest over there. The balconies are the sharing laundry room and then balcony where for the entrepreneurs and make the new friends. This is the uh, prices for the accommodation. We are offering a discounted rate for the students, especially. If any student wants to go for the uh, uh, two bedroom, one bedroom, a studio, or uh, separate apartments, so can easily. The, and uh, this uh, this uh, PDF is also, I also share with, uh, share with the, uh, Deepa. Uh, she will share with you exactly what kind of what are real prices of and what we are offering. Okay, so at least we are if a student go for the 30 to 90 days, we are offering 10% discount for the students, 90 to 27 days, 15%, and 180 to 27 days, uh, to, uh, to 70 days, we are offering 25%, 20%. And for the if you book for the one year, we are offering the 25% uh, discount for the rates. Okay. No, so almost I covered all the things. Uh, if you are any other queries, though, please let me know. Uh, I'll clear the, all the things and uh, Ashwin, Ashwin, also. Please. Uh, Mr. Anand Patel is asking for the PhD programs. So as of now, uh, we are not uh, offering the PhD program. Very soon, uh, we are going to open the new campus in uh, UAE and Gulf countries. So over there, we are uh, start the level six and level seven programs. So uh, and the fees can be paid in installment. Yes, a student can pay the fee in installment, but uh, before visa process, we uh, student need to pay the uh, fifty percent uh, fees uh, plus uh, visa process. At least if you go for the uh, uh, level three program and initially he have to pay for uh, 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 the 25,000, 20,000 uh, for the tuition fee and 5,000 for the visa process. And the rest of the amount he can pay in the installments and two or three installments. Once he reach over there, he can be paid. There's no issue. Uh, does the spouse have a work permit? Uh, 
So once we start the level seven, then uh, we uh, get the, this uh, answer uh, that time. Because right now we have not offering the level seven programs in uh, Dubai campus. Okay. Any other questions or any query, to please uh, ask me. I think we have covered all the questions. Ms. Ashu has given the uh, uh, response on the, all the... If I, anyone has any uh, questions or any query? Uh, no, Siraj, I don't think so because you have covered almost each and every aspect okay, regarding accommodation okay. and the life in Dubai. What are the facilities available near the accommodation, the courses, the fees, everything. So I don't think any other questions are there from the team members, so, but if the agents are having questions, they can surely ask you. I'm sorry for that because uh, from the yesterday, I have some throat distraction too, so the, my voice is not here proper. Yeah, but so like, we we, we really voice. appreciate that, that you have completed the entire session nicely and covered all the things. Uh, uh, if any question or any query, the please ask. If not, then we can end the session. Is anyone having uh, any questions? Can please write or speak up, please. Hello. I think there is a question regarding accommodation. 1275 AED is the cost per month. That's correct. It's per month. Yes, accommodation. Yes. It's a per month. Yes, huh? we have had the two BDR apartments we have. We have. We are providing a good. Although we have a, a special uh, prices, uh, we have a special fees uh, for those who have paid the uh, full fee. So if any student uh, paid the full fee, uh, we are offering the uh, one year accommodation, a free accommodation. Okay, we have not availed any kind of the scholarship or any facility. In that scenario, uh, we are offering the student. If he has one short payment, uh, 40,000 dirham to the GPS, so we are offering the one-year accommodation. So please, this is a very uh, good chance for the, those students who, who are not uh, very willing to go outside uh, and uh, do the full consultation of the uh, academics. Ashu, ma'am, please, if you have any, uh, tell anything about to, please. I think, Siraj, you have covered everything very, very nicely. Uh, you know, the same things which you've just covered. Uh, we offer scholarship to the students as well. So in case if a student won't, we can offer him up to 25% of scholarship on the fees, annual fees, the first year fees. And the balance of the fees, the student can, student do have an option to pay 50% in advance and the balance fees in installments. That is one offer which we can give to the students. And second is if the student is not interested to take a scholarship and he is willing to pay the first year fees in full in the first, uh, in the beginning uh, before the visa, we are happy to give a one year full accommodation to the student. And this offer, these both offers are for January intake. Other than that, if you guys still have any questions, even the partners, those who are available here, Deepa, I think has all the answers for you to, you know, share with you. If you Actually, have any questions. I would concerns. like to add a few points. Like uh, Dubai is like a good destination for the students. It's a growing destination and the job opportunities for the students are like a lot. And, uh, it's a, like the country is developing, okay? And it's safe country. It is affordable for the students. IELTS is not mandatory. There are many, many benefits to study in this country, okay, in Dubai. So it's surely a place to explore and to recruit students for. If you are like, it's new destination, which no, everyone knows, but like surely we can look into it. And since the benefits are lots, we can surely start recruiting the students. And I'm sure that if... Uh, we start with one or two students, then ultimately this, that students would be giving the reference of other students and we will we can increase the number of student enrollments in the Dubai universities or maybe in GBS Dubai itself.
so i believe that there are no more questions from anyone okay. and we can now end the session okay okay so siraj okay. i would like to thank you for your time even ashu ma'am mm -hmm. i would like to thank you for your time thanks for your yeah. presence over there and sharing your valuable comments and feedback like all the the important things which are necessary to be mentioned in a webinar are everything is covered thank you to both of you uh, thank, thank you deepa for uh, organizing this session the so, pleasure is all mine because like we are looking for recruiting students for such a wonderful destination and we really hope that this session help us to at least generate the inquiries for the dubai universities and gbs dubai <laughs> Thank you so much, Deepa. Thank you for all your efforts and putting this session together. Thanks. Great. Thank you, yeah, guys. Have a nice day, both of you, everyone. Yeah. Thank bye. you. Bye. 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 Take care. Bye.